uh, stroke. Let's, let's practice some, keep, keep practicing some strokes before we do the whole. This, this head stroke, this head stroke, mm. it's one stroke. And this is how we do it. It's like a drop of water mm. or like uh, the um, quotation mark. Oh, yeah. Thing. Okay. So it has a little, uh, we, we would reverse the, okay, like the reverse of the, uh, of the first stroke. So you, you expose the tip, then you, you hide it. <laughs> okay. Expose the tip and then hide it. <laughs> yeah, it goes, okay, if I draw the, the trace of the, the guide, yeah, stroke guide, it will be like, uh, it goes up a little bit and then goes down immediately and then goes back like that. Mm. It will be even the, like that. So if, let me do a bigger one so you can see. Okay, you, you can you can you can repeat the a little bit, okay, and then press, and then mm, up. come back. Yeah. Press. My brush, uh, but that will be a big bird like a uh, turkey maybe. <laughs> 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 but normally we just use the uh, one third of the uh, brush. Okay. Uh, if you need a larger stroke, you change to. Big brush. Big brush. Yeah, uh -huh. We do have bigger brushes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So <coughs> normally we stay with the life size. We don't ex mm. enlarge it. Or you know, so, oh, uh, so but some birds will be. Uh, yes, yeah, so sparrow will be the, the best. <laughs> this hen nut is a little bit larger than life, maybe. So you can do a little bit smaller, but uh, uh, it's okay to paint exactly like that. Um, actually, when we do with the rice paper, you, you can trace it. The rice paper is uh, kind of translucent. Mm -hmm. uh, you can put it on, on the top and still see the... Well, we have to use ink, but a lot. Oh, like yeah, that yeah. Yeah. Mm. yeah, you, you can put it like... A, so this is... A, yeah, you, you can use, a, you can u use a ink to trace it like that. But we do it later. <laughs> Um, any question? Okay, so okay. make sure the the, the, the first part question? is the, the top half of that uh, eye uh, glass. <laughs> yeah. Is <Yeah. laughs> the eye um, circle. Mm -hmm. So you that's why we leave a space. Mm -hmm. If you don't, if you know, somebody don't uh, leave that space, my teacher uh, does that on the top of the stroke. You, you know, you, you kind of uh, do the eyebrows, mm -hmm. eyebrows maybe. So you you leave the uh, space. Otherwise, <coughs> you can you know a lot of people just do that, and then when you when you add, mm. the eye will be that. So this this is easier mm -hmm. later to do the eye mm -hmm. and then the you know the beak. Mm -hmm. Okay. So this is the top of the. Uh, so that that that. So you become a little. Uh, you press a little bit. To make it like uh, the forehead, mm -hmm. so you the, on the handout is kind of extreme. It may, it may be in certain perspective we don't see the forehead, so it could be very narrow mm -hmm. above the eye. Or you, if you want to make the eye, exaggerate the eye size to make it big, uh, you can you can just do a little line, mm -hmm. just like that. You oh. can make it the thicker. Mm -hmm. to, you know, it, it, I, I really like style, you know, I like that style with a very big eye. Mm -hmm. That's why I do the uh, line, the uh, yeah, thin, uh, yeah, thin, yeah, thin, thin line. Like yeah. a tail on the yeah, tail. Yeah, you can consider that just eyebrows and then the uh, combined with the, the head, the, mm -hmm. the rest of the head. This is so cute. Okay, let Our me... Alright. Um, so the next two th part is the wing. Um, we will do the tail before the wing because the tail and the back um, are the same tone, usually, you know, gray okay. something or, or colored, mm. and then the the wing is darker. Okay. Um, okay. So let's say w if we did the back like that. And make sure the this part is is kind of loose, 
it could be dry brush. Okay, not my brush is too wet. So this is a loose, and then the tail. You don't want to have the tail um, connect with the the lower back mm. uh, too solid. You know, leave some space. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of puffy, or, or, you know, with a little. Uh, so. The way to do that is you you end the back with a soft brush, mm -hmm. I, mean, I mean dry brush, mm -hmm. and then a soft edge. Mm -hmm. Then you start the ta the tail with a soft. So that com mm -hmm. that that area is is kind of uh, like that. Okay. So two strokes. Yeah, two strokes for the. So it starts from um, ex tip ex exposed mm -hmm. and then press down, kind of. So more solid. You just pulse more a little bit. Yeah, you don't have to go back. But the idea is uh, pulse, mm. and then you 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 add another second stroke. Is like that, just overlapping with the first one. So one big it, the feather in the front, mm -hmm. then the uh, the the left or right maybe is the far side and the mm. near side, right? So it has some perspective. Um, like that, like that. Uh, you can, you can make the end a little wider, so it's a, um, a little pronounced triangle shape. Maybe. Triangle. Yeah, triangle. Okay, that's the tail. And some, you, if you make it, you know, flying birds, the tail may spread out. Spread like out more. Yeah, more like that. But mm -hmm. uh, in, we'll do the standing birds to start with. Flying bird is more advanced. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is already advanced for us. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, the the head. Uh, then you know you you can you you can change uh, into. Oh, let me see the 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 wings. We we need to do the wings. Um, we will we'll use. Darker ink, when we use in ink later. The flying feather is longest. Uh, th there's some, I don't really know the, the name for the bird's anat autonomy. Yeah. Uh, the flying feather, know. primary, secondary, yeah. or something <laughs> like that. So we, um, my teacher just told me the, uh, like three strokes. Um. One long, one middle, and one short. Uh, to okay. stack together to create this fold, folded wing. And then on the other side, just two strokes, like a, one long, one, sh one short. Okay. This is the, <coughs> yes, the, the, the idea. So um. yeah, you can see on the handout. Wow, you're reading your bird. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's great. And then um, most of the bird has a light colored uh, chest mm -hmm. and a, um, belly. So we, we do that just with one, um, one long stroke, but we can break it up, break it up into um, some dotted lines. You don't want to make it too um, connected. connected. To make it more interesting, the neck could be uh, like, a, like this, oh. so some, some feather. To start with, like but this is a, uh, like a one, like yeah, one stroke. So you you just uh, put uh, some short feather oh, so on the neck, and, neck and then the long and then you chest and the belly in one one circle, uh, one curve. You can you can have a you can have a break mm -hmm. between the long break the the long line. We call that. Uh, Idea complete with absence of stroke. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, so you can use a dryer brush. You, 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 if you, if you, you get used to this, uh, this uh, process. You, you feel the water, so you can, you can make it more um, feathery. Uh, mm -hmm. you know, like mm -hmm. a, yeah. Wow! But if you don't get it the first time, you can't go over. It. You, c you can't. <laughs> <laughs> you can go over if you use dry brush. That's what the, the uh, you can you can do it little by little, little with a uh, dry brush, but, but with a yeah with a with a wet, wet brush, brush <laughs> you will be, it. you will see it. Yeah, 
Okay. Um, so the belly and the back combined to create this kind of egg shape. That's the um, the, and and another I mean you, 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 it's a gesture maybe a diagram. Mm -hmm. So the reason we we start from the body is because the the head moves and the tail moves. Mm -hmm. uh, so you you kind of do the stable part first, mm -hmm. then you capture mm -hmm. the gesture. Uh, um, mm -hmm. So if it's a bird, maybe we'll later we'll, we'll do mm -hmm. live birds. Oh. <laughs> uh, mm -hmm. We'll see that. Yeah. So uh -huh. you can you can uh, you can draw a neck. And then break it into uh, back and the and the belly, you know, with the wings, right? So, so that's that's the the basic uh, shape of the the bird. The two circles. One is the uh, the body. head and body. Uh, head. Yeah. So the neck um, between the the body and the uh, shoulder or uh, uh, the the uh, head is the sh it, it's uh, the neck for some birds like uh, you know uh, obviously the the crane has long neck mm -hmm. every bird has a very long neck actually mm -hmm. especially hummingbirds very long it could be <laughs> when you s uh, so just to keep in mind the birds has neck <laughs> yeah. Yeah. otherwise it will be like a chicks. Right. Okay. Baby chick. Baby chick. Yeah. <laughs> so the birds is a little uh, different than mm -hmm. baby chick. Yeah. I can do a baby ch baby chick. A baby chick is like a, the egg, right? From the egg, and uh -huh. then the, the the head is right. Right. Ro on top. Right on top. Of that that's a baby chick. Uh -huh. With no no. Um, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. That, that's. Basically, mm -hmm. uh, a neck with a, a neck. Yeah, yeah. If you want to make it a, a bird, uh, it would be a little, little longer with wings, uh, more advanced. You know, the, the baby chick doesn't have wings. No right? wings yet. Yeah. Then the, the, the this this kind of neck and the, so that that would be a, a bird. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so that, yeah. So that that's the idea of uh, egg and the. Wow. Uh, no, that was too strong. Yes. <laughs> yeah, you you can use the. That's why the brush is easier than drawing. So you you can just use one. Uh, basically, you draw a, a, like a two strokes to to make a, a egg shape, uh -huh. and then you add that the head, mm -hmm. and then just add you know the beak. That that's basically a bird already, and then you add. Uh, tail and uh, wing, right? Um, speaking of the posture or, or gesture of the bird, notice that uh, I don't uh, paint the beak and the uh, tail on one line, mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. it, a lot of people just do s something like a so this is a mm. this is a very steel <laughs> bird. Mm -hmm. um, no no movement, mm. right? This is wrong. Mm -hmm. Try to make it see this is a, uh, try to vary the direction of the head so that the head could turn to the top and then the tail could turn down mm. uh, or tail up head down. Just vary the directions, okay? Yeah, you can try some uh, different uh, um, different posture for with this diagram. Just try one head down, one head, uh, one one version uh, with the head up, okay, and then one uh, with head uh, tail down, and one another with the tail up. So the body and the tail should should vary. The, the tail should go either up or down. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can you can if it's really still and uh, standing, it could be like that. But the wing could go a little up or down. It just vary the mm. the uh, avoid that. Okay, very good. The beak. Okay, now we go to 
the beak, very important. But it looks like a parrot. I, I already <laughs> see uh, you, you're doing the beak. I haven't uh, taught you that I don't blame you for, <laughs> for oh any no. mistakes. Okay, so the beak and the eye. Uh, mm -hmm. Let me draw a bigger one so you can see yeah, better. Yeah, I how do you get it like that? Yeah. <laughs> so a little white. Uh, that's the the head that stroke we learned, right? Then the the we can do oh, the eye. Two strokes. Yeah, two strokes. Just leave a little highlight oh. on top. Oh. The, the, uh, okay. And then uh, you can either draw the the eyeglass, you know, or or uh, leave it the eye circle, okay? And then the beak, okay, it's not in, in the front of the eye, but uh, it's a little under. Mm -hmm. So that, this is the, the, the mouth, the, the middle line. Mm -hmm. It's a little under, and then the top line is a little thicker. The top portion mm -hmm. of the, the beak is thicker. So they're not like an equal. Uh, like that. <laughs> this. Uh, That's the parrot. Yeah. That's the parrot. <laughs> uh, there's there's some like a big mouse. The horn yeah, and yeah, the yeah. <laughs> but but generally speaking, still you know the top oh, part. Yeah, I, yeah. I tried. My teacher actually uh, think the birds is personal. Like uh, they have expression. Mm -hmm. They personalize. So you can express the birds. Uh, express your feelings through the birds uh -huh. uh, mm -hmm. to make it happy. You can make the singing birds instead of uh, doing this. Is maybe the more natural, you know, um, the realistic beak, right? It, it curves like inward or mm. like, or flat. Mm. Maybe you know, just straight. But I make it a little bit curved, kind of um, uh, open, you know, to make it mm. happier. So this mm. is more smile, mm. smile. Mm -hmm. the, if you want to make the birds angry, this is what I do. Just do. Mm. Yeah, this is angry. Oh, yeah. Oh, this the way uh, uh, yeah, this is a uh, uh, smile. Mm. Uh, okay. Oh, the bottom one is the uh, one also that is yeah. This this could be a little. At least you don't bend this way. Mm -hmm. You could just keep it straight. Uh, keep it either str uh, yeah the bottom one could be a little um, yeah, bent funky, you know, right funky so that that really makes the bird happier, it's happier a lot happier and it's actually angry. yeah you can you can make the eye smile you know like that so it's a it's a little um, little tip you know just uh, to make the birds more uh, happier. <laughs> okay. Uh, the Is claw. it better yeah. to hold the brush down close or up high? Uh, that's a good question. I would say if you do the detail, like the, the little bird beard, <laughs> you or the detail like uh, the eyes, you, you can hold the lower. Closer. Yeah, okay. and then um, when you do, I don't think you you, you need to hold Not this high. <laughs> if on this Middle. side, yeah, you, unless you do the 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 uh, the long mountain or uh, branches yeah oh, okay so yeah for depends on the the size okay. of the stroke gotcha. okay the claw oh, I said feet okay yeah. my English was bad <laughs> when I yeah. was uh, this, claw, is, this is this uh, this is an old uh, handout from nineteen ninety when I taught first in Seattle uh, mm. okay the claw is uh, uh, like this, three strokes maybe in the side view, uh, one, and you can overlap either on top or on the bottom. Two, I I will do it on the outside, uh -huh. and then so this is the front, and then you, the, the what is called the talon, 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 yeah, and this is the the shot. This is what they call pollen. Pollen, yeah. <laughs> okay, and some bird, some uh, times oh. we do the leg, sometimes not. It depends on um, how it's standing. Yeah, how it how put the perspective standing, or right? Or With the little birds, you you just need to, like a hummingbird. You don't really, you don't really see that. Just little. 
three strokes. You know. In the front view, yeah, just the uh, three, three strokes like that. The middle one is always longer. Mm. And uh, um, we we usually do the claw before the branch, so the branch would come from the claw. Yeah, well, well, you can wide that, so it w the claw would, it would be in front. Mm -hmm. It's kind of hard to paint wet into wet if you do. So you do the birds first, then you add and the then you do branch. Uh -huh. yeah. yeah, okay. You. Yeah. Usually I use this tiny brush for the details, like mm. uh, the uh, leg, uh, the yeah, the leg and the feet. Okay. Any. So there's always one. Okay, on the brush stroke, uh. one side is always thinner and the other side is thicker. So um. do you always finish with the thick side, or do you start with the thick side okay. and thin it out? Yeah. <laughs> Remember the feather. We, yeah. we 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 do it like that. Yeah, more. So you can you can also use this. Uh, there, yeah. Good, that cause that's a good question. Uh, we we hold the brush basically in two positions, but something in be or something in between. So one is a, a perpendicular to the paper. Mm -hmm. Another way is a, a slant. Mm -hmm. So if you do the slant, mm -hmm. um, the the brush will be broader. So you start the broad. And uh, usually the the side with the tip will be smooth, and then the, the other side is rough. Um, the another way is to use uh, this, you know, keep the brush tip in the center. So usually this this is for drawing the li lines, right? Mm -hmm. But you can also use it to, to draw surface. This is what, what we do, especially with birds. We need to mm -hmm. dry the brush with uh, with the paper towel, especially the heel, mm -hmm. so no water because the water will come down if you dry the tip. Only oh, water yeah. it won't work. <laughs> so the, I dry the the, the bottom mm -hmm. and then uh, s spread the brush. Then mm -hmm. you can do. If this is the easier way. Okay. Yeah, to create the feather. Mm -hmm. Feather. Okay. I'll show you more with the uh, paper now. Um, so you, yeah, I think you are ready for the paper. She is. <laughs> 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 I don't know. I'm just. Not uh, I can only do it in the same yeah. direction. With the uh, with the <laughs> the paper, you can. Uh, if you are not uh, confident, so you can mm -hmm. put the uh, uh, the hand out. Oh, under, under the it. Paper. Yeah. So it you, you, it to, as a guide. Later you can uh, paint without it. Okay. I have. Uh, <laughs> I know. I like this paper. <laughs> okay, you can stay with that. You can stay with that. Uh, no, no problem. So we we are at our own pace. You don't have to do it uh, to, together. Uh, okay. So I would I would use. Uh, Okay, let me use ink, right? Um, you have the, your grind stone and the ink stick, right? You can start so. grinding it. I don't know how to do she it. Doesn't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. This, I don't she know anything. She's never yeah, used that, it. Just put a little uh, water. Okay. In oh, here. you, oh, you right got the time. color one. You, do you have a black one? Yeah, here's a black one. Okay. Here. Yeah, just put some, you can use the brush as a spoon. You can okay. also use a spoon if you want. And just then put yeah. water in the small one or the big one? The big one, okay. yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we, we have this uh, um, ink, convenient ink cake. Uh -huh. You don't have to grind. Okay. Uh, we do have this for sale if you want. Let me just let you share this one. I, I got another one for myself. Maybe. Oh, I can just use ink, I think. Bottled ink. And then I just rub it on here? Yeah, just uh, kind of like grind uh, in circular motion. Uh, if you can, yeah, so put it flat. Flat just like this? Yeah, just the uh, no, 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 no. Oh. Oh, <laughs> the end side. This side. Oh, you, it's not flat. Okay. Yeah, just the yeah. whole surface. Okay. Yeah, not just the corner. Okay. Okay. Well, it looks uh, sounds like a very hard. Sounds. Yeah. Yeah, because some of those, uh, um, this is what we call the souvenir. 
that are not really good uh, yeah, artists. Yeah, that's quite, yeah that, just for decorate. Something is happening. Yeah, it's, <laughs> a, it's a. I I've seen people mount the ink in the frame in the hand. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, it's like decoration, not not really. Oh, so it's more practical. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think we we do have. If you like, we we have the uh, uh, the ink sticks, mm -hmm. just yeah for for practical purpose. Okay. And I have ink. If you want, you can just use a little bit of ink with the water. It will make it easier. Okay. Just one drop of uh, ink. The one drop of ink. Yeah, just one drop, and then you'll get it. This is <coughs> this is a concentrated ink, very dark. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I'm going to do this uh, bird in color. Okay. All right. Um, I have. Uh, let me see. We can use the stiff brush or the soft brush. I should way. take this paper. Yeah. yeah, you can. I have one uh, under your your pad. Oh, under yeah. my phone. Yeah. Ha -ha. Oh, you can. Um, uh, don't want the pad got stand. So just we have the pad on the table already. Oh. Yeah, just uh, take it away. Yeah, just okay, put a, put away that water. Yeah. That's the magic class, uh, what magic class we call it. Yeah. Magic. Magic class. Yeah. Magic class. I should buy some magic class. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we do, we do have it for sale. Everything, um, we have everything. All right. So okay. when. Now it's the real this deal. Is for okay. I'm going to show you how to do this in ink now. Okay. Um, I'll I'll just repeat this diagram so you you can see how the well, yeah we we got some light with water just preparing for that mm -hmm. and you can just uh, touch a little dark on the tip mm -hmm. and so if you want the feather just dry the bottom of the brush mm -hmm. with the paper towel and then just. This is a, a sized, sized uh, means uh, uh, resist, mm -hmm. resist uh, uh, solution. Is a is a uh, made of uh, alum and the glue. Mm. Uh, in paper industry called size. Watercolor paper are all sized. Huh. Yeah. So it's not uh, bleed that much as uh, unsized. Okay. Size. That that paper is more like an size. I mean the water, the practice uh, oh cloth. Yeah. yeah. So this is this is the, the you can make it even drier. So. With dry brush, yeah. To start, there is you can have more moisture to start with on top. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Just to keep the ink away you from from this. <laughs> yeah, you could use some paper. There's paper underneath it. Yeah. Okay. Oh, this guy's actually really good. Yeah. Let me let me get this. Yeah. Let me no, let me repeat try. this uh, three times, just right. like this. Okay. Yes. Uh, so. It is very different texture. See, so this is one stroke. So it's overlapping, just like the ring coat I mentioned, like so the. The the ancient raincoats. Ancient raincoats, yeah. 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 So notice that they are uh, kind of tied together with uh, towards the the head, right? The radiate, kind mm. of, yeah. mm. not just uh, flat. Kind of. And you can make a shoulder. Uh, more solid on the on the front, mm -hmm. like here. This part could be s like, a, a, like this, this yeah. 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 a little solid. That's the, the shoulder of the bird. Okay. And uh, I do this here. Okay. So I start from the center. Mm -hmm. That. You you don't want to do the the whole uh, body in one stroke. Okay. Uh, you break it up into like the length of little uh, 
feather is this mm. small, but very short, right? Only the wings are long, <laughs> the, the ah, feather, okay. flying feather. So this feather is very, and then you, you kind of spread it, spread it to, to the sides and then down. See, this is, the stroke is like uh, this size. Mm -hmm. This, this, okay, this size. If you miss some, you, you can um, make it up. Uh, if it's not feathery, that you can use paper towel help to, mm, to repeat that. Yeah, but uh, if you keep working on wetting it wet, it may smear. Music is wet and wet. So, yeah, so it may smear too much, so you will need to be aware of the moisture. You can make the, the, the upper part more solid, more, you know, more moisture mm -hmm. than the lower part. As I mentioned, the reason is to um, connect the tail naturally. So the tail is not like a stick on the <laughs> there. Yeah. So like, this is this is the the tail, right? the uh, the tail stroke. Oh. It's, uh, it's like this. You you I use darker ink uh, and then dry the brush and make it a little split. You can. So I don't want it to. Too too sharp, so mm -hmm. I make it a, a little sp a split, mm -hmm. and then uh, press like that. Mm -hmm. If I didn't do it, I can repeat without uh, lifting it, just like that. Mm. Kind of uh, fake it <laughs> a little bit. Oh yeah, I like that too. Mm -hmm. Okay, so like uh, you mentioned, uh, I can do the beginning thinner and mm -hmm. then end with a thicker ah. yeah so this is the the stroke also the wings could be that way you can you can start with lower pressure and then um, press down okay mm -hmm. kind of pull but press um, remember I talked about the direction so this is kind of too straight so I would I will make it a little lower so if the line goes more mm, like this too way, connected yeah, yeah. Too so straight. I make this little dot. It doesn't look alive enough. Yeah, okay. So this could be a little split in the end. That looks more natural to me. And you can add a little, um, little tail. Um, what bridge, maybe. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> Between the two sections, like that, okay, you can add some under feather, like the, the lighter ones, especially when you see from bo uh, bottom, you mm -hmm. see the white That's ones. Yeah. Yeah. <coughs> okay, now uh, I'll add the wing. I use dark ink, so you will cover, and besides, uh, the dark will not bleed that much, okay? so. I'll do the longer one first. So this is the the shoulder. I don't have to combine all things, but you know, keep that in mind, that the structure in mind. So that's the tail. Okay. And then second long, then a shorter one. You can combine this to make it more solid. That that could be adjusted. You don't have to do it one stroke, but it looks like one stroke mm -hmm. in the end. And then the far side, it's only that look at the the hand out. Okay, this mm -hmm, is the mm -hmm. yeah. that's the body part. Okay, I have to repeat <laughs> the the back again. So I need to get some light. Okay. I will repeat the from the beginning again, if you look at uh, mm -hmm. this again. So I try, you know, I make these variations so you can see, you know, some hard, uh, like the ink tone is, th it doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. it, could, it depends on the, the bird, could be blue, could be yellow, but the stroke are the same. Right? Oh, so yeah. I, I just use lighter ink, so you can see each, each ink could be different, but uh, this is better than just show you one 
when you, like, example, you have yeah, to be exactly like that, that, that tone. It's not, but you have to, um, the essence is the structure. Um, mm -hmm. yeah. So I tried to show you the variables also. Um, so this case, I can make the tail a little bit maybe um, different. So I, I make the tail up. This is what I do. Uh, I change direction from the previous sample. So this is the you can make make like, like that. Okay. And then I'll do the dark. I will make the ring goes down like that. So the tail is in front of that ring. And then this wing could be further down. It's like a prepared for flying, or, or you can go up, I think. My thing is, uh, you don't want to um, make both wings spread. You yeah. make one tight, still tight, and then one, one uh, could be spread. Okay. Let me show you uh, another thing. If you do the open wing, it will be f seven strokes, roughly. Whoa. You don't have to count. One, two, three, four, five, six, about roughly seven or eight. Mm -hmm. But the, uh, if you really want to know, it's about the maximum will be 13 mm. flying feathers. I think that's my teacher told me. Mm. If you count them, yeah. Okay. <laughs> now I, I will add the, the, the head, so we can do the head. Ooh, you've got flying wings! <laughs> cool! Yeah, see, this is a, the head stroke, okay? Okay, that's too big. And the head is, just you start stroke. with the tip out, right? Yeah, tip, okay. uh, tip, tip come out exposed. First. Tip, tip exposed first, yeah, and yeah. then hide it after. Yeah, see this one, I I can either, I still have the option to do it in front, or um, backwards, so let's just keep it easy, front. Yeah. So that's, that's the fine bird. Oh, you just do, uh, like the eye is like in two strokes. Isn't okay, it? yeah. Let me because it's so thin, I can't. Mine is so fat. Um, <laughs> you can you can do in one stroke if you want, uh, but to just add a little uh, highlight. That's the reason I add I add a little stroke to mm -hmm. create uh, yeah. that 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 yeah, uh, highlight mm -hmm. the, the yeah. spot the white spot in the mm -hmm. eye. That, that's why we do it in two strokes. Um, one, one stroke will work if you want to make a just smile eye or, you know, with a, yeah, one line, one, it will be okay. So let me do this one. See, I can do in one stroke like a, yeah, a little yeah. kick, it mm -hmm. can also do that. So there are many ways. This one I did like, 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 like that, I just leave it, mm -hmm. leave a stroke. So basically just a dot. And then you can add a stroke, mm -hmm. but um, the if you if I tell you two strokes, ma many students will do this. You know, like mm -hmm. a doesn't uh, make sense. Yeah, a little why. <laughs> 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 you maybe do a little we, mm -hmm. a little check mark, a check mark, a very very tiny check check mark mm -hmm. stroke. Yeah. Okay. And then uh, we add the beak. That's the difficult part. Um, we just make it simple. Uh, just uh, one, two, and uh, three. Okay. The the sh uh, bottom one could be very uh, close okay. to the middle one, uh, and then you can also do the nose. That's true. Yeah. Uh, okay. I'll do this one too. 
as you can see. I'll do the center first. Remember the center is it's a little um, along the same line as the eye, and or even a little lower. Okay, so but not uh, not to in the front or just in front. Maybe if I draw the circle here, see that's about it. Where the circle is. Yeah, where just end outside the mm -hmm. touch the circle. Touch so, the circle. Yeah. Touch the circle. Yeah, mm -hmm. and then the nose actually also touch the circle. Oh, okay. If you look at uh, my diagram, um, they cannot. This is, you can see that. Mm -hmm. right? And then we can make it this a uh, scene, perhaps. You can use a smaller brush. Mm. Yeah, we have a smaller brush. <laughs> okay. Now, um, to do the belly, the neck, I would, I would dilute the ink again. So I just dry the brush. Instead of wash the whole brush, in the end, you can see my water will be still clean. Because mm. the reason I do that is I use some paper towel to dry the ink. Mm. And then I just stick a little water, it becomes very diluted. Mm. So I don't have to wash the whole uh, brush. Mm. So this is, this is what I do. Mm. And one, two, the neck. I don't s really see that belly, I mean the, the chest here. Okay, now the, the um, leg and the, pump, the claw. One. This has bone. This part, you don't have, to, you don't want to use side of the brush. Mm. It's straight. Mm -hmm. you, you hold the brush straight. And then, so you get this tiny, and the, oh, this one. Okay, this is maybe too big, <laughs> mm. too big, could be smaller. I have big feet, I always <laughs> do animals with big feet. 40, 44 size <laughs> shoes, yeah, so this is too big. Okay, the flying birds, yeah. you, 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 you kind of like a f uh, hidden under the, the uh, belly. Mm, the other side of the wing. Yeah. Oh, you're just taking off, actually, this one. Uh, I didn't really think about the, what uh, exactly mm -hmm. the, the person is doing. Anyway, let me do some more um, while you practice. Okay, so Jesse is... Uh, yeah, uh, okay. <laughs> the faces are so funny. <laughs> 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 Yeah, remember the curve. You, if you curve, uh, if we make the upper line straight, just make more straight. Yeah, not a curve inside. Yeah, that's the the um, tip. You know, the yeah. trick to make it um, the birds happier, more not happy. angry. Let's see. If you if you if you just bend this a little bit, I think. Yeah, just keep it straight. I think. Okay. Not to curved. Not too curvy. Not a curvy. Yeah. yeah, I think mine is a little too curvy because they look very angry. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's that's my uh, smile, smiling bird. Oh yeah, you brought a smiley one. Okay, there are many uh, birds that has the f white face mm -hmm. or the white uh, yeah, breast. neck, breast. Mm -hmm. We need to leave white because we don't use white uh, in watercolor, same as. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's mm -hmm. uh, the also the reason you know we we uh, you can do the dark first in that case. Let me do a bird uh, with the dark marks like the sparrows. Uh, they have this kind of white, big white um, chin <laughs> or mm -hmm. yeah, something like that. Uh, So you can you can just leave the white, mm -hmm. and then you do the dark mark, dark dark, 
around the eye, and we will use color for the head. Yeah, like kind of yeah, and then the, the the belly should be just uh, light. With the white part, we just outline it yeah, like that. Mm -hmm. and, yeah, and then uh, the the shoulder, we use brown. This is brown, could be brown, and you can use uh, you can if there's a eye eyebrows, you 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 have to leave it like that. Mm -hmm. Just, just leave it. Um, you have to pl plan ahead. Mm -hmm. we, we don't use pen pencil. Just uh, you can use charcoal. Pencil will not work on rice paper because rice paper is too thin. Mm -hmm. This is this is a, a, a kind of white chest, white throat, throat, right? White mm -hmm. throat, yeah. And on hummingbird, it will be red. Red. The mm -hmm. male, yeah, yeah, especially. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, These are so cute. Yeah, they're <laughs> so cute. So you're you're going to do some uh, on the on the paper. I think we'll try. Okay. Time um, to try. Yeah. That's a. Uh, you just put the, this under the paper, see how that works. Okay. Yeah. Sounds good. Good yeah. idea. <laughs> yeah. Let me let me do that also, so you can follow. Just put the bird in the golden roll position. You know what what is golden roll? Yeah. The roll, they're thirds. Okay. Oh. When you when you take a picture, you should also put the face uh, of the f person in the thirds. Right? Mm. So. If you if you if you uh, create some grid, you don't have to do this, but let me show you how to do it. Mm -hmm. uh, so you just make a search, yeah. and you will see the crossing okay. line. Let's see. Roughly, you don't have to be very accurate because the paper. Uh, it's okay to get some wrinkle. We use paper weight. To hold, kind of stretch it. Mm -hmm. um, then we mount it to make it. We stretch it afterwards. Not like mm -hmm. a watercolor. We stretch it first. We, mm -hmm. we stretch. It. Can you pass that ink to me? Thank you. Okay. Yeah, you can use uh, this as your ink. Let right. me just put it in here. And you have to use a palette to dilute the ink. Uh, you can use one of these, maybe, to, as a palette. Okay. Just use this for light ink, to lighten the ink. Okay. okay. Yeah. And then the clean water. I use the paper towel or so to adjust the moisture. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let me, let me do this. I put this first in the, uh, maybe, not in, in the dead center, maybe somewhere here or uh, somewhere here that would be because the if if you if some person you know you know picture facing this way you should have lo more room on yeah on the on the uh, left side so mm -hmm. yeah I, so i would do the i would just put uh, right here right yeah you, if it's a small you you it's just avoid the center that would be mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. just put it anywhere you want Okay, and now I'll use a uh, soft brush, I think. With, uh, with a little uh, water, uh, just a little ink, a lot of water to get, to get a dark gray, not too, too light, not maybe. Yeah. Oh. Maybe half and half, at least. Ink. This ink can be diluted up to 40 times. Wow. wow. So, so yeah. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can get lots of water in that to get uh, a dark gray. Okay. I, I'm using mulberry paper. It's a little bit uh, different. Mm. This is a uh, semi-absorbent. Mm. Uh, yours is a non-absorbent, so it will not stand the the candle. This one might, mm -hmm. but it's okay. I just um, do that. So, 
use paper towel to dry the brush mm -hmm. bottom, the heel. Yeah. And then split the, the front. Um, sometimes it's easier with bare hand, bare mm -hmm. fingers, because it's, with paper towels, you cannot really do that. And then you clean your, your, your finger mm -hmm. with, uh, mm -hmm. with paper towel. Okay. All right. Ready. Ready? <laughs> start from the start from the the, the body the body, the, the, the back. Okay. Okay. Just just like that and then do the, the raincoat. You don't have to worry about the uh, the uh, we call it flying white in the beginning because uh, you, you want to the top part actually pretty solid. Mm. No, no, no white. Okay. Mm. Then you gradually you can add you can add some ink to it. So in the beginning it could be uh, more dry, but uh, more white. But mm -hmm. you can add some. Oh. See on the handout. As I, you, I also as did you put more. Yeah. Okay. You can you can darken it, too, but in the, yeah, mm -hmm. you can always uh, go back to add add some dark ink to it. L near the the lower part, you need to make sure you create some uh, soft strokes, soft textures, so like, uh, like that. Sometimes I just use the 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 what do you call the narrow side of the flat to create the lines. You know, mm. you can also do that, but it's in that more natural. Just use the split. You can use, you can even just you know not not evenly split, you, you can have some space in between, mm -hmm. that's more natural to me. Okay. Yeah. Just create some uh, feathery effect. Don't have to be oh, yes, perfect, yes, yeah, that's, that's a very good, yeah. very good. You don't have to be like, perfect, just the uh, idea. Okay. I think I, I, I missed the focal point of my mm -hmm. audience there. <coughs> Sorry about that. Mm -hmm. I touched the mic. Oh, uh, my. Okay. We have six audience. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now I'm going to, I can do the, uh, either the, the head or the tail. Because I got dark, I, I'll do the, the head first. Head. You can do the tail if, if it's still light, a lot of light on your brush. Um, yeah. And you can, you can also create a soft connection between the head and the, the shoulder. That's the, the neck could be more Mm. more uh, soft, uh, mm -hmm. softer, so it, it's not solid, it, mm -hmm. it shows the, the uh, flexibility <laughs> maybe, but they're combined, okay, you can, you can have some soft combi combination on that one, and uh, the tail, remember, you start from soft and then you end with a solid, mm -hmm. so just do like that. Well, this stroke is sorry. That's, that's okay. I, I just add some, some some soft like softness like that. And I, the next stroke I can do. And I make sure it's not solid there, so you, you create the same. Mm. Um, you you don't. You, you know it. Sometimes it goes. You see, battery is almost off. Okay. Yeah. Mm. Do the, the wings. Yeah. Yeah. Dark. yeah, with the dark because the dark will cover this dark. part. Uh, only the dark can cover this. It can go crossing the the, the wing. So I make a. Let me see. Yeah, I think. So. I have to go. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, you can you can peek. Uh, I I yeah actually I can see here. There's the oh, top one. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's yeah. that's the one. Oh yeah. Okay. And then. So the left wing first, and then the the right is only a suggestion. The tip of the the right there. Okay, now I can do the detail on the uh, face, the, the eye. I, I just do it in one stroke. Sometimes you know, I need to make it up that uh, you just do a little circle but without closing that leave a break, a little mm -hmm. highlight mm -hmm. on the top. Okay, and then I complete this uh, eye circle, the lower half. You already leave the first half in the in the first stroke I did mm -hmm. on the head, right? So this is the okay. right. See that? Yeah. Yeah. If you feel uh, not to, if you like, you can use smaller brush for the details no. yeah. or the stiff brush, the brown one. Where? Yeah. 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 Okay. Small one here too. okay. Yeah. For the, for the, yeah, for the beak, I will use the, the stiff brush. Mm -hmm. This brown one is a stiffer than okay. the, the white one. Okay. So, yeah. remember we talked about the the expression. Yeah. So we just keep it the keep it straight. No curve. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's the safest. If you yeah, if you right. forgot which way to which curve, way to curve? <laughs> <laughs> just do it straight. Okay. Just do it straight, and then curve a little bit on the top. It's okay. You so you go from the tip down. Yeah, tip down. I just take advantage of the natural tip. I make it a really sharp tip, and uh -huh. then just pull it. Yeah, pull it evenly. And this one, uh, I want to make it a little happier. So I curve a little bit, just a little bit. Mm -hmm. The lower part. There's tongue. We we have to uh, use in the color painting. We use a little pink. With oh, but with the, yeah, here I just use the same thing. Just a very uh, very suggestive. Near the if you do the same birds, we can add the tongue. It's a near the uh, if you look at the handout. I this have a stroke. Oh yeah, yeah, on, small yeah just going up the very short. With hummingbird, they have lot, lot long tongue in the front. Right. That's a different story. Okay, so I'm done with the light, uh, the darkening. I'm gonna have to, I have to shift back to light. What I do, uh, I, I dry the brush with a paper towel mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. just stick some clean water mm -hmm. and just. Uh, they, if That's it's still too dark, do it again until you get the light tone, okay. and then uh, adjust the moisture. Make sure it's not too wet, and then uh, with this, we can. On the handout, I have a combination of line and the uh, wash. Okay, mm -hmm, if mm -hmm. if you have that, um, I'd, I'll do the line first. Mm -hmm. Just two two uh, short strokes for the neck, and then the long one starting from the, the chest goes all the way to the, this is the chest part and then the belly will go from light weight light pressure to heavy pressure again so I vary the pressure see so I start the heavier then lift and then press again press again yeah lift and pressing to get the variation of the um, the line, so it's not a, like a wire. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Understand? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. That was okay. good, Mom. Oh, my fingers are so cute. I like his face. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You can add secondary wings just a little bit on the f the. Um, the left wing, right? Uh, just two more, like strokes. two more strokes. Yeah. Uh, stacking them, oh, uh, fold, folded. Okay. Just a yeah. kind of um, 
over there. We got some birds here, beautiful oh. Rufus. <laughs> okay, so I'll use a smaller brush again, this stiff brush to do the leg and then the claw. This kind of suggest you just make it you know feel like there are two or th actually there's three on the front but you only see two one and a half maybe. Yeah. <coughs> The chest is a little too dark, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but that's okay. You, you, some birds have like a claws; <laughs> it could be all dark. That's okay. Yeah, it's okay. Oh, do I need to put anything here for the neck? Um, that's a good question. I have some. Uh, you can, yeah, you can, you can wash it. You can, you can put uh, uh, light ink mm -hmm. to shade it. Yeah, it just looks funny. Yeah, some my belly is too dark. I know. <laughs> yeah, there there are some birds with uh, like a red, orange. That kind of is often here. That's you know very common with some oh. some vibrant mm -hmm. colors mm -hmm. like uh, oranges or something like that. Yeah. So yeah, yeah, we can just good. It's cute. We we can just use Perfect. the same. You can do this. This is what I do. I just use same ink. Just mm. you know, just do some uh, scratches. Mm -hmm. Just light, light ink scratches, and you can also scratch, just like shading, you know, a little bit where you, yeah, just soften that line, you know, somehow. You can make a dark snow, a dark like a black throat if you want, like some um, sparrows. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Darken your body type. So this is this will be the like the complete. You can, uh, we don't use white, but you could, if you uh, want to cover it up, you know, you, you can use white mm -hmm. as well. Let me see where I got white. The gouache. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 That's fine. Yeah. It's just every new stroke it becomes a new type of but if you use yeah. white, <laughs> you have to use a very clean, um, brush for the white here. Yeah. Anyway, I'm going to add branches. So now I take this handout away. I don't need that anymore. You can see my my paper is absorbent. That that's why oh, you got to through. Uh, through. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Now uh, I would add a branch. Uh, we can. We can take this as a reference, but uh, it's not going to be the same. We can use this mm -hmm. this uh, mm -hmm. branch, okay? okay? But uh, this poster is kind of hard, but you can try it later. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me, um, let me use just a leftover, leftover ink here. Mm -hmm. um, when I do the composition, now Actually, every stroke is composition. We've already started to mm -hmm. place the bird in on the golden focal point. Uh -huh. Sorry, I touched the camera again. Oh dear. Okay, sorry, audience. Mm -hmm. Let me focus on my. The starting point, okay, this one's almost to uh, um, the center. That's, that's not, um, that's a risky. Composition. I won't say it's uh, wrong, but uh, you know, but you because I kept everything else on on the mm -hmm. on one side, so it's not uh, symmetrical. Mm -hmm. So I, I'll put the beginning point on one of these two, or these two, or or this. So there are eight positions to start the the branch oh. in Chinese. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Right. Yeah. So avoid the center the, and the corners. You don't want to start from the corner or start from the center. All right, so I start from number one, two, number two position right here. So this is what I do. I just follow this, okay. And then hmm. uh, 
and uh, this is the beginning part. In the beginning, uh, we we should we should uh, we should we should break the the edge to suggest more pictures outside the frame. That that's very different than still life. We do everything within the um, the table, the platform. It, this is a uh, uh, we call it. Uh, Still alive. <laughs> That's my <laughs> word. <laughs> so <laughs> yeah, so not alive. a dead branch, but uh, something you 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 see in the nature. Connected yeah, something. connected to something. There's, there's a whole tree mm. uh, yeah. outside the, my frame. Okay, mm -hmm. that's the reason we do that. And then you can imagine that tree. So there's a there's a, um, a long branch. We call this kind of branch a chi branch, energy mm. branch. Chi, oh. Yeah, mm. energy branch. Okay. Actually, you can see some uh, blooming winter winter sweet of the flower where I'm doing. Mm -hmm. it's in, yeah, it, it smells really good. Later, you can go oh, outside yeah. to smell it. Uh, just uh, under that pool, that uh -huh. you can see the white. Uh, I mean the uh, the yellow, oh, yeah, waxy yeah, yeah. yellow. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's the flower I I, I I try to do. Okay, so this this branch is an, like a long one. Yeah, they, they, sometimes they come with leaves still. So this one, um, I'm going to ch I'll change a little bit because if I continue, it will be in the center part. I want to maybe break that line uh, towards the top so I can change directions a little bit. Okay. So I leave space for the flowers, for the flowers in front of the, the branch. Uh, yeah. So this one will go behind. I create triangles when I making cross uh, uh, crossing mm, branches. Branches. Yeah. So you this one can go this way. Um, I just follow this. This one. Um, this will be some flowers there. So looks like I need another another call. Mm. Right. So go like that. Then yeah. change directions. Mm. Cool. <laughs> yeah. So that's uh, uh, now we, we apply the principle of uh, steel yard, okay, balance. So you need to have something balance, mm. balance steel yard, like the the hanging scale. scale mm -hmm. yeah. Now we have line and uh, uh, kind of uh, shape. Uh, what we need is more dots. The flower will be dots. So line, shape, and the dots. Mm -hmm. Three uh, elements, like music. Mm -hmm. you, 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 have a, um, you have a good piece with all these elements. So this is what we call the mass dots. Moss, M O S S. Mm -hmm. yeah. You can put in anywhere you need, <laughs> um, but with a rhythm, with uh, some uh, intervals that mm -hmm. are not equal uh, or size vary the, the size to create uh, some uh, rhythm. Mm -hmm. Right. And mm -hmm. you can Moss does. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay, or your branches. Yeah. So then we'll do the flowers. Okay. You can you can add more branches. Uh, let me just think. Sometimes I just see a, a wrinkle that inspired me. <laughs> like mm -hmm. looks like a, a branch. That you, actually you can use fingertip mm -hmm. to to kind of uh, uh, test. Do you, do you like that line to 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 go up there? Mm. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah let me just yes. extend extend yeah. that line and I try to f create mm -hmm. a, a, a tendency that not goes everywhere. Just mm -hmm. you know, it goes. It yeah, yeah, that go, go, yeah, a S shape or something like mm -hmm. has a uh, dominant direction. In the beginning, I don't use my. Uh, right brain. Now I have more rational mm -hmm. kind of uh, um, in the towards the end. In the beginning, just go with the instinct, you know, that intuition. Mm -hmm. But now I, I'm kind of mm -hmm. yeah, more logical. Mm. Okay. This, so that that. You see the shape of the negative space. Mm -hmm. um, this is the big shape, yeah. the, you know. So not uh, not equally divided, mm -hmm. but uh, with the big empty space, small empty space, and the, uh, tiny empty. So this is all space. Yeah. Mm -hmm. When I draw lines, I think about space, dividing mm -hmm. space. Yeah. So this is the the, the um, key. Okay. Um, yeah, just try to add some branch. All right. Create uh, some uh, um, negative space. Divide the paper into negative space. It, it dries lighter, so not so, so uh, dark at mm. all. Yeah, I think because the, the the back is light, so you can reverse it. It's it's okay. Some birds have dark chest, the light <laughs> back. It's okay. Mm -hmm. It it doesn't bother me at all. Okay, the 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 wing on this side could be a little. Here. Uh, you more can add right. yeah more, more two more strokes or a couple more strokes. Mm. There. To oh, yeah, to yeah. make it uh, look like a um, yeah the wing the primary feathers you don't need the white I think you just go to the side. all right let's see how you're doing. So just are you going to do you need more Should paper? I do another paper? <laughs> I put too many birds on my paper. <laughs> Is it yeah. okay if I use another yeah, one? Yeah, yeah. Feel free to. No, yeah. This is too feathery. Um, oh the, okay. It's bamboo. Yeah, it's, that's a bamboo leaf. It's bamboo. Yeah. It's okay. The bird is on the bamboo, no problem. Right, we got bamboo, uh, yeah. with birds on, on the bamboo always. Yeah, it's no problem. Yeah, that's... Um, the branch could be uh, draw with the, the tip concealed, yeah. you know, tip concealed, tip centered stroke, we call it. Concealed. Concealed means hidden. Hidden. Yeah. So you do the hide tag the where you hide the tip. Hide the tip, tagging mm -hmm. the brush. Like our first body one. Right? Yeah, you can, you, can, you can still make it up if you want. <laughs> Uh, you, you, yeah, you can change it if you want to huh. change it back to the t uh, not the bamboo I if you want. Very thick here. Um, let me show you. Okay, you don't want to do the bamboo. <laughs> I then I have to learn how to do the rest bamboo. I'm not sure. Um, there is a good bamboo leaf actually. You can just do that bamboo. See, advanced bamboo. Okay, don't don't. Yeah, the, all the, my best suggestion is uh, don't. Um, Mess with that. Okay. Just uh, complete the other part. Right. You can, you can, you can see we have uh, bamboo and a, a plum together okay. right, in our garden. Yeah. If you look at that, 
there are branches. So you just continue with the branches. Okay. Just, you know, bamboo is bamboo, uh, palm is palm. Still. Okay. You don't have to define them right now. All right, good. <laughs> you know, I, I think at this point, you don't think uh, what is what, what. Just think about line, uh -huh. uh, next to space, mm. shape, that kind of thing. And you can define it uh, later. Okay. Yeah. Should I do the same one as them, or should I try this one? Try the tie knot. Exactly. Try this one? Yeah, yeah. Or try this one? Uh, try that one. Try the complete tie knot. This one? No, no, the oh, second one. Yeah, okay, okay, yeah, okay. Yeah. Just put it underneath your Underneath paper. my paper. Okay, yeah. here. I have my own. Yeah. Okay. And uh, you have to move around to find the, uh, yeah, the, the correct the, place. Uh, Maybe in the... In yeah, these this are corner? This this corner? May, I think, yeah, on this lower corner. Lower corner, okay. Because, uh, uh, I think that's... Better. In the middle one? Yeah, just, this is the center, so okay. this is good. Okay. And you can extend that. Here, this extend the branch more. Okay. So, uh, let me to complete this so I can stop recording. Okay. And it'll cover you more. Okay. Um, oh, <laughs> I, could, I, I have to change this water because mm -hmm. I'm going to apply some uh, yellow, very tender color. I don't want to stain the yellows. Okay, let me clean this water first. I'll be back. Okay. Good job, guys. I took the falling flower, so I mm -hmm. have a model Ooh. to show you. Pretty. See, mm. this is the, the winter sweet. It really uh, smells really fragrant. Yeah. Mm. yeah. So I just put uh, this uh, here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I can I can draw the. Yeah. Um, in, in painting the light flower, we usually use um, light ink to outline it. Mm -hmm. It's better than using um, color, then you have to make the background dark mm -hmm. to show it, because yellow doesn't show on white. Mm -hmm. So I use light ink, very light ink. And then we just draw this. Let me focus on this part. Okay, I just draw this flower. There, one, two, three. When I draw a flower, I, I count the petals. Uh -huh. Normally, the, the plant flower is five, but this flower has multiple petals. Mm. Um, it's, not, it's not a plant family. We call it no. a yellow uh, wax plum, but uh, oh. actually, winter sweet is the name of it. Uh, it's not really a plum. Yeah, we, we just draw this. Suggestively, um, there's a little, there's no stamen, unlike mm -hmm. unlike the uh, plum, yeah, 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 the cherry, mm -hmm. yeah, cherry. We just, I think there's some, uh, just little tiny, pollen. So we just do that, and I would, I would see the back. So maybe it, there's the calyx is is a dark brown, very contrast color. Suggestively, so the 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 shape of the petal is more important. It's like a oval, oval shape. Mm. Okay, then um, I'll do a side view, facing this way. Maybe facing. Sorry about the noise. Okay. Uh, 
lot of but. Mm. Lot of but. It's just a little circle. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, I I have a painting I did. Uh, This is a more realistic painting I did. Mm -hmm. uh, it's like, a, uh, is it in oil, believe it or not? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. I did it uh, with oil paint on a wow. uh, Jap Japanese uh, uh, board. Mm. Okay, this is, yeah. But I have to like uh, make it the dark, the background even darker to show it. Oh. Uh, it's, it's a really light flower, mm -hmm. so um, difficult to paint with a uh, yellow on on, wh on white background. Mm -hmm. Well, we can try to wash the sky <laughs> mm -hmm. if you want, but uh, it's kind of hard for beginners. <laughs> it's uh, <laughs> too much. Uh, Okay, um, just maybe another. So I tried to vary the, the groove, big groove and small groove. Okay, I'll just do I just try to paint with uh, all the accident <laughs> effect, mm -hmm. <laughs> so I don't have to worry about the paper wrinkles mm -hmm. and all that. Dot the calyx with uh, some uh, brown, I think. Just get some. Uh, color. Just gray it down with some green. Mute it with this, uh, this green. Green and brown. Just gray it. <laughs> I need. You don't want to use pure colors. Mm -hmm. Just uh, green it. So just dot some uh, calyx. Mm -hmm. Calyx in, mm -hmm. uh, under the. On the back of the flower, you can see here it's a uh, brown, light brown color. Okay, now uh, I will wash the petals with the uh, yellow. Oh, you're color. Yeah, I have a yellow which is already a mix of uh, white and the yellow. So it's called a, 
what is it called? Oh, this is a lemon yellow. Wow. Lemon yellow is not what I want. Okay. This one is a uh, Naples ye yellow. Yeah. What is it? Yeah, it's a uh, opaque yellow. You can mix white with yellow, get the same color. This is I mix this to make it a really, really realistic color. This is it's turned brown, but it's it's like a very tender. I, I can also uh, to avoid avoid uh, covering the light mm -hmm. the lines. Okay, what I do is I I turn the paper over mm -hmm. and then just pinch uh, oh. like that. Oh wow! So I don't have to worry about uh, covering ah. covering it. Wow. And it's more subtle. Hmm. Wow! Yeah. This is the the best part of the uh, rice paper. You paint on both sides. See, that, that doesn't cover us. Yeah. You can also avoid it <laughs> if you want. You can, you can, you can have cover some, but avoid. Mm. But you, you can combine both. You can enhance it like that. <laughs> so you, you can on both sides. Mm -hmm. Try that. Try, try that. Let Ooh, Rebecca, it, you know. your bread just looks so good. See, I, I, I can paint on either Where side. <laughs> Willow. <laughs> okay, that's uh, uh thank you. Um I think the center could have some um, green maybe a little bit like a pollen uh, a little bit green. Just, yeah, just a, a contrast color, you know. Uh, uh, orange, actually, it should be orange. Mm. It, I just use uh, green. Okay, maybe just a little more brown. A little dark. M maybe it stands for the pistol, <laughs> the uh, female, uh, female, uh, what do you call it? Pistol, right? Mm. Same and pistol. There are some more. Yeah, that's a. I didn't show you how to do the branches. We didn't practice on the on the um, uh, magic <laughs> class. You need to. <laughs> I thought it is. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I think actually branches is uh, like a bamboo. You know, very difficult uh, um, stroke. You have to practice the calligraphy. Oh. But you did very good. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Um, when you do long lines, you, you hold the brush high, higher and or use the arm with your shoulder. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, I can color the birds as well. Let me show you what we can do. We can, we can use some brown. We can use some brown to, co to color the body a little bit mm. and, ah. and some uh, some yellow uh, brown maybe. let me see I think that the beak should be a little blue
blue gray or something. Or just the ink. Yeah. Mud, uh, and, uh, you can you can you can put a little yellow in the eye or make it uh, pop. Some some yellow in the in the eye. And uh, the tongue actually could be done with uh, uh, pink. You could you, usually we don't use light. Uh, we use pink only, not the uh, ink. Even just uh, give it a soft. Beautiful. Thank you. Wow. <laughs> this is uh, for your gift. <laughs> for your for your birthday. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to write your name, <laughs> your birth year or something, oh. celebration. Oh, okay. Nice. Uh, so, May, uh, how do you say your name again? Margie. 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 Isn't uh, Margie. Margie? Margie is not a bird, right? <laughs> <laughs> Margie. Look like uh, ma in, in Chinese like we bird call bird it Ma Chie. The Chinese name is Ma Chie. Isn't like Margie? <laughs> ma Chie <laughs> means a sparrow. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I will write uh, uh, your name in Chinese, Ma Chue. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. You got a Chinese name, yeah. Sparrow. Yeah. <laughs> in Chinese, Ma Chue. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, Ma Chue means uh, uh, Sparrow, but it uh, sounds like magic. Yes, yes. I will just say happy birthday to Ma Chue, okay? Yeah, perfect. <laughs> Yeah, in, in Chinese painting, calligraphy is part of the composition. That's why they leave mm. a lot of room mm. for, for that. Yeah. You can write occasion, uh, the, the uh, uh, place, the, the date, or everything, uh, even a, a poem. Mm. Uh, should I write uh, your age? <laughs> birthday, yeah. big birthday. Yeah. Right? Sure. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's my big special birthday. birthday. Yeah, yeah. It's so a 60s birthday. It's a uh, it says sixties birthday, uh, mm -hmm. happy sixties birthday uh, to Ma Ma Chue. Yeah. Sparrow. Yeah, sparrow. Okay, and I will write the year and the date. We're still in two thousand nineteen. Yeah. yeah, that's good. Today is the uh, thirties. Yeah. Ready. Ready. Okay, so it yeah, says uh, <coughs> 2019, uh February uh December thirties. Mm -hmm. uh, my name. Uh-huh. <laughs> B my last name. Xiao mm -hmm. Hui. <coughs> That's my Chinese name. Okay, and I got, I'll put the seal. Oh. Mm -hmm. That's beautiful. Mm -hmm. Yay. Happy birthday! Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me let me finish that. Perfect. The bird. Perfect. And it 
looks like a U because of the uh, the glass. <laughs> 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 Yeah, you can see the, 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 the bird has glass. <laughs> <laughs> it looks just like you. Yeah. Okay. Um, I have a seal I carved for my, my 60th birthday. Because oh. in China, we have a, a, ter uh, a, a, a phrase, mm -hmm. or what we call this, a, 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 a name for each big birthday, birthday, like a 30th, mm -hmm. uh, 30th birthday, we call it Independence Day, <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> something like that. Mm -hmm. can, 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 uh, our 40s, we have no doubt today, because uh, you become uh, more, uh, you know. Confident. Yeah. yeah and then 50s is uh, knowing the destiny day. Uh, the 60s is this. I want to explain this later. <laughs> this, this, uh, no, the sixties is called. It's hard to say. Uh, obedient oh. year. Oh, obedient year, year means uh, you you don't feel against any any uh, thing you hear. Everything is yeah, everything is uh, everything is smooth. smooth yeah, ah. calm. Mm. We become calm, more comfort to ah. towards ah. what what oh. others uh, yeah, say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So you don't really be picky to what you heard uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. or see yeah. or or so yeah it's a it's Confucius a quote you can search for this uh, uh, in in Confucius mm -hmm. uh, quotes yeah. Yeah. yeah yeah it's a uh, obedient ear that's Ooh. that's obedient ear so you don't really respond or react to to things as before, Extra, yeah, yeah. yeah. Temper less, maybe. <laughs> mm -hmm. more, yeah. more acceptable, more, you know, yeah, more, tolerant, you know. Mm -hmm. more tolerant. More yeah. tolerant, yeah. yeah. That's kind of... Looks good, guys. So I'm going to put uh, this here. We call that, uh, in function, we call this uh, a side seal. Mm. Obedient ear. It could be a beginning, beginning seal, on, uh, right oh, here. Well but I just, I just put mm -hmm. it on the same line because it, it reads like a, this is my. Remember, I talked about steel head, steel yard. Mm -hmm. This is the steel yard line mm -hmm. right, to kind of everything, yeah. uh, everything Where along. It yeah, it, this yeah. is steel line composition basically. Beautiful. Yeah. So it makes your eye kind of. Uh, mm -hmm. Leveled on that line. It's not leveled, I mean, but it flows. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's yeah. going it's a nice like a yeah, flows on hang, hang on that line. Yeah. Yeah, that's the hang line. Nice, good job, guys. Okay, let me. Yeah, you did very nice. Okay, the this is just the name seal. It goes under the sig or beside the signature, mm -hmm. just like a period uh, of the painting. Mm -hmm. so I'll just put it right here. Oh, so that's the name, and that's a special for. It's called mood seal. Oh. Mood seal uh, could be anything. It could mark a life event, typically. Oh. Yeah. When I had my surgery, I make a seal because oh. <laughs> I remove my. Brother, I, I made the seals. Uh -huh. uh, so uh, yeah, so for, 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 for that. Oh. I, I, yeah, a life event. So I passed 60, I made this seal. So every painting I did this year have this uh, mm. uh, obedient ears. It looks like ear, right? You can see that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. the ear obedient. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And lastly, I put a, a, a corner seal. With, um, it's my studio seal. Oh. Yeah. Studio seal. Yeah, that's. And y'all uh, make it in. Yeah, I'm a seal engraving artist, also. So oh. Yeah, yeah. So that wow. that that you see the triangle yeah. of the seals. That's also um, part of the composition. Part of the composition. Yeah. yeah. 
that, oh. that um, actually, if you if you if you look at this beginning and it goes here, uh, that block, yeah. it, it kind of stop. That's mm -hmm. a stop, mm -hmm. and then you turn. You have to turn this way, mm -hmm. and then and uh, and, and, here. and here, yeah. So that that that's the uh, mm -hmm. movement of the, the composition. Yeah. And we don't do the background. Um, I just leave it white. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's in your view in the in the audience mind, the, mm -hmm. the sky or yeah. the, uh, you finish the in your mind. So um, if you want to frame it, you have to mount it to eliminate the the, mm -hmm. the wrinkles. And we use uh, silicone paper. We can just iron it on on the back, make it flat. Mm -hmm. I, yeah, if you if you like, we can do that for a little uh, charge. Mm -hmm. I can frame, I can uh, mount it so you can frame it oh. <laughs> easily. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> Okay, yeah, it will be forty dollars for for the frame, for the mounting. We can do it after the class, after the, after you finish your project. Okay, what time is it now? Eleven thirty. Eleven thirty. So we have half hour. Finish your your work. Yeah. Oh, you are late, so we can extend that. <laughs> Make it up. <laughs> Yeah, we said what nine thirty to twelve thirty. Yeah. Oh yeah, you said nine nine thirty, right? I think nine thirty to oh. twelve thirty. Oh, I okay. I forgot. I I I thought it was nine. Okay, so you're on time. Mm -hmm. so we're on time. I, I thought it was I think nine. Your yeah. re, your reminder, I think, said nine thirty. Yeah. Oh, yeah. okay. Reminder nine thirty to twelve thirty. Oh, I forgot. I didn't <laughs> check my. I just oh, that's what you call. I thought you were yeah, late. Yeah, I thought you were late. We yeah. thought, oh, we're on time. <laughs> uh, I see. Uh, you're on time. I'm sorry. I, oh, I no. just got old and forgot things. <laughs> <laughs> I'm yeah. 60. Yeah. <laughs> exactly, I agree. Yeah, we forgot things uh, uh -huh. right away. <laughs> Okay, let me put this uh, flower here. Make it a little rounder. Actually, there's wild version of this flower. This one is really nice. You can see the roundness. The wild, uh, if we oh, yeah. see it on the mountains, you know, uh, uh, the wild flower is uh, exactly like this. It's a, it's a pointed mm, tip. More pointed. Yeah, more it's like a lotus and got uh, more like, um, yeah, this is more like the wild. Uh, Flower, yeah. but it's okay. You don't have. You can use color to make it, make it uh, to cover okay. it yeah, to make it rounder. You can cover up the. Uh, yeah, don't try to repeat that. You just uh, <laughs> it's just like a think of the the lines like a sh the shady, and then the white just like like the, the highlight. So they combine. Mm -hmm. So you can you can you use white to correct it. So you can just do the the line half. Like uh, you put uh, on the shady part of a ladder, mm -hmm. when you do that kind of shade on, on the, your ladder, mm -hmm. on your, on your um, yeah, you you only do the shady part mm -hmm. with the line. So you uh, the highlight the the lighted part could be uh, absent or narrow. Mm -hmm. you just do the lower part, so to speak, mm -hmm. of the petal with uh, more ink. But you don't have to just. Uh, <laughs> I I'll put this on the on the board so you, you okay. can see yeah. it. Mm -hmm. I will do another one for for you just the extra because we have time. A mouse, or oh, actually a pig. Oh. <laughs> a pig. A piggy and a mouse for next year for everybody. Um, let me show you what to do. Pig. Yeah. Right. Pig. Yes, next year we're going to have a mouse baby. Um, oh. A mouse baby coming. Oh, I didn't realize. <laughs> Congratulations. Oh, no, I'll do for the mouse baby then. <laughs> let, me, let me do that uh, for you folks. Oh. 
Okay. No, oh, I didn't realize. <laughs> Great, Mars baby. My, my brother is Mars. Yeah. 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 Oh, but I forgot about my flowers also. Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> you just need some more over there. You need a few more together. Together. So this is, a, you know, in Chinese painting, we always paint the season or the occasion. Mm -hmm. uh, that's very um, in, you know, to the, mm. in twin with the natural. Mm -hmm. So the, the, the new year, we must do something special. To, mm. So that's why Aww. I think... Uh, do you like the mouse with the uh, gray or just white? Oh, maybe. No, you choose. I chose, okay. Okay, let me do a mouse for you, for you baby. Oh, okay. Thank you. Oh, cute, huh? Rebecca's looks like you also. I think that's it. Oh, so cute! Oh my goodness, that's okay. so cute. Uh, I was just say, what what do we say in English with, uh, for expecting baby or mm. something? Yeah. Uh, just the uh, what's your name, Jesse's. Jesse. Happy, happy twenty twenty. <laughs> mm -hmm. I just said happy, happy uh, last year. Yeah. Auspicious, auspicious year of the mm, rat. The rat Good flower mm -hmm. to do. Okay. Two 
your name yeah. your name sounds like a music jazz, right? Yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Jewish. <laughs> Jewish? Yeah. But just jazz the uh, it's not like a not like a lady. Yeah. yeah. Sometimes it's a man's name. Like yeah. my husband, his grandpa is Jess. Oh. So, but my full name is Jessica. Oh Jessica. Yeah. Jessica. Let me just yeah. write yeah. Jessica. Yeah. And my Chinese name Jessica. is what? Jessica. Precious cherry blossom. Oh really? Yeah. Precious cherry blossom. Right. Oh, so you no, have plum. 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 Oh, May. 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 Yeah. May. Uh, yeah. uh, precious means. Uh, bao. Bao May. Ah, oh, so just write bao May. Yeah. Oh, precious plum. I always can't remember. Okay, let me just write bao May. I don't want to draw another light on but oh, you, you have a small one. Yeah. It's okay, whatever is meant yeah. to be is meant yeah. to be. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they also exist like this one. Uh, I don't know about exactly, but <laughs> it's got some. I like your favorite package. I will say mother of the rat. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> exactly. Should I do a little baby? <laughs> oh, could be. Yeah. Okay. okay. Is that the same black ink? It just. Oh, uh, same same black ink. Mm -hmm. I I just use a little little. Uh, oh, a bit of blue. Yeah, a little bit of blue, maybe a little bit of everything here. Just uh, just great uh, a little bit, and then I'll just do. See this, watch it, you have to watch this. Uh -huh. uh, just one stroke, okay, one stroke. And watch this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Tiny baby. Yeah. <laughs> and just Looking at mama. Yeah, and then we just start with the Wow, so it's a little pink. want to go on um, uh, Cerritos, uh -huh. uh, I think uh, February 5th, no fun. and uh, a little far in Grandel, the 19th Americana Mall, very mm. nice place, yeah. with oh. a fountain you know, around. Uh, Grandma Sharon would like to go too. Yeah, go there on the 19th, and, and we uh, yeah. paint uh, you everything, yeah, you mm. can get this, but you got this today already. But yeah. basically, I'm, this is what I'm doing, but I'll do just one stroke for for, Whoa, for all the animals. For all the oh, animals wow. Yeah. wow. So there are people who will be waiting for two hours to get this <laughs> every year. <laughs> very long line, so I just, I just oh. do very fast. That's why I learned um, this. To do it uh, fast. Wow. Yeah, this is for. Oh, let me put the seals, then I will do yours. Yeah. Okay. Here, these are and clean. what's your symbol? Yellow. Do you know? Uh, dragon. Dragon. Wow. She's a and dragon. her baby yes. is a dog. Oh. <laughs> so, yeah. 
I like Jorgen. Jorgen is my favorite. Jorgen is my father too. I know, I want to find out another baby and play dragon. For dragon? Yeah. <laughs> You're going to wait for a dragon baby? <laughs> Maybe the third. Yeah, you can get some more. Okay, that's for so Jessica. Beautiful. Yay! <laughs> if you want it. I love the baby now. So too. cute. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> okay, I'm going to go to Joe. Oh, I wait for Peggy to, to see. I draw a, a dragon, maybe. Mm. Oh, that would be nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. The dragon uh, in ch in in west is green, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, oh, it's green. Yeah. Why in Chinese China? What color is the dragon? R red. red, usually, right? Red. Yeah. Right. Oh, she's come back. Let me do the, the mm -hmm. pick. <coughs> I got green, so I'll just do a green pick, maybe. <laughs> mm -hmm. Cute. Okay. I'm going to do the pick Thank for you. you. What's this? I was going to do dragon, so I got green in it. Oh, now you have a green pick. But she's not so big. So let me just. Oh, I can't do it. Yes. So cute. I got this gold. Oh. And. Wow, the ears are so cute. Golden coin. Oh, uh -huh. <laughs> in the piggy bank. Mm -hmm. Perfect. <laughs> and we need to do some flower decoration. <laughs> <coughs> okay. You know the furong, uh, fugui, or it, it could be peony or something. Mm -hmm. uh, just. Uh, Decorative. Means of good fortune. Yeah. Okay.
Mm. 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 <laughs> this is the end of pick a year. Oh. <laughs> the, the pick a year, the end of pick a yeah. year. Just write your, your name dedicated to you. Oh, thank you. This first oh. seal again. Mm -hmm. Let's put it right here. Yeah, here. <laughs> the obedient ear. Yeah, the obedient ear. That's and uh, I think on the 17 we'll be uh, doing anything you want. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good year. Yeah. Second last year. Anything you want. And then eight, eight is, uh, I think. I don't want to do That's it. I think after 70, every year should be everything yeah. you want. Anything no you more. want. No more. No more celebration. So cute. Mm -hmm. so Big fortune cute. Uh, for Maggie. Oh. Maggie. <laughs> and uh, the year of the pick, end of the pick year, this is the tail of the uh -huh. pick. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Now I'll do the dragon for dragon. for for Rebecca. what's your name? Rebecca. Rebecca. Okay. Rebecca. What's your Chinese name, Rebecca? I don't know. You don't have a Chinese name? I thought I was like. We have to. Oh, we should give you one. Sh no, yet. Yeah. Not yet, huh? <laughs> no, your precious pearl. Pearl. Baoju. But like Ju is like a pig. <laughs> uh, Baoju? Oh, I, I think pearl. Pearl, yeah. I'll, I'll do a dragon precious with pearl. Pearl. Yeah. Oh. pearl. Yeah, that's that's you. Okay, great. <laughs> Baoju, Baomi. Okay. How do you say peach? Do you know? Peach tao? Tao? Oh yeah. Mm. That's what we should call it. Yeah, uh, tao. Tao, peach, okay. So you want to have a pearl, that's uh, what you want. Okay, let's hold up your painting. Very good. Thank Very you. good. Yeah. Very good teacher. Yes. Okay, now let's do the pearl first. I'll just do this. And from there. Yeah, you can make a video if you want. This is called Whoa. wisdom pearl, right? Wisdom pearl. Wisdom pearl. What's the pro? And then we do the dragon. I think we got this one here. Let's do the dragon. Oh, keep it simple. Uh, 
Come on. Oh. <laughs> That's the whisker. <laughs> okay. And now the eye. It's a uh, old oh, jacket. Mm. Beard. Write to your name in Chinese. Bao mm -hmm. <laughs> That's the pearl. Bao zhu. Pearl. Pearl is in Chinese too. Mm -hmm. Okay. Keep it simple, I think. Mm -hmm. Cool. Cool. <laughs> 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 The New Year, Happy New Year. Mm -hmm. Just with my last name, mm -hmm. I find my 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 uh, first name, mm -hmm. and then with the seal. Oh, the seal is with the last, last name. name. Yeah. Okay, and Li Xiao Hui Li. Okay, and uh, then we just put uh, studio. It's a it's a uh, pigment with a, a reed flag fibers. Oh. Reed flag fibers, yeah. Mm -hmm. A special plant that goes in, uh, into the paste. Mm -hmm. And there are some many ingredients like uh, even gold <laughs> could be. <laughs> oh, wow. uh, s some uh, herbs, you know, something. Mm -hmm. There are eight treasures in it, if you read that, uh, it's already done. Oh, so, it eight know. treasures, uh, seal paste. Mm. It's a uh, very high, high quality mm. product. It says the bubble. Mm. Eight precious oh. <laughs> bubble in me. Yeah. There's an eight uh, precious uh, ingredients. Okay. Yeah. That's good to know. Yeah. Should I put my birth seal there? Sure, yeah. Okay. I think that will balance that diagonal. Mm. Will be good. Mm. 
So, yeah. when, when people see this here, they know the age I did it. Yeah. <laughs> That's mm -hmm. the opinion. Yeah. Okay. This one is my name. Your uh, precious mm -hmm. uh, poor uh, happy New Year, year. happy uh, yeah, yeah, and this one is your name. My uh, year of peak, end mm. of uh, the year of peak. Sui mo yi hai means uh, the year of peak. Oh, uh, the okay. Chinese uh, branch and the, what they call uh, stem and branch. Uh, Code for this year is oh. high. Yeah. means uh, pick. Huh. Next year we uh, uh, gen, gen, yeah, uh, gen, gen, I think. Yeah, but not yet. Until January twenty-five, oh. we mm. still use the old, the old, old yeah, code. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, yeah, like my. Brother was born in the beginning of February, so mm. sometimes he is uh, oh, <laughs> crossing. Yeah, he's 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 the tail, rat, tail yeah. of the tail of the rat. Yeah, so yeah. It's actually, mm. yeah, he's, he was born in the year of the ox, ox but like actually the tail. Like oh, oh, yeah. yeah. So she was in. Oh, you're an ox. Yeah. So I should do an ox for you. <laughs> 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 we we'll just found another reason <laughs> to do a <laughs> painting. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I love them, right? I know. Yeah. Oh, thank you. <coughs> but, uh, I should take a picture of them. They all love to be all to be Okay, I'm going to get the ox. Oh, yeah, i got to watch the ox tutorial. Yeah, I'll wait for you. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, his ring, his nose. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Cute. <laughs> okay. Box. I love it. So cool. So, uh, Jesse's bald me. Yeah. Bald Okay, this is complicated. Usually I write uh, this. But uh, I did uh, simplify it. That's mm -hmm. okay. Mm -hmm. It's the same word. Yeah. Also learned some uh, Chinese zodiac mm -hmm. yeah, <laughs> for us for the first first symbols. I got a lesson uh, on YouTube. It's free. Mm. Uh, you can watch all s uh, twelve of them and just paint for uh, others, oh, just your family, family yeah, for the family. new year. Oh, that's 
we have to practice a lot first. <laughs> yeah, I should uh, uh, stroke and when stroke yeah. older. Oh. I have that uh, with a handout. Uh, uh, I have a class if you want to join. Oh. I got you got uh, uh, handouts and uh, you can you know, discuss questions. And like that. Okay, this so is so cute. <laughs> I love it. Happy New Year for thank you. Yeah. Happy New Year. Okay, let's uh, see what time we are at. Twelve or oh five. Let me see what you did, and maybe we can okay. we can finish yours with a signature. Mm -hmm. And oh, I draw the seal okay. for you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, what's your last name? My last name is Hernandez. Oh, Hernandez. Yeah, we all have different. Names. Oh, yeah. oh. <laughs> oh, it's different. So yeah. forget about that. <laughs> <laughs> we can all put Daniel. Yeah, we can put Daniel. Our, our mm -hmm. original last name. Mm -hmm. Or we can put Chan, my mom's original Oh, Chan's. Last yeah, name. Chan. Yeah, yeah. Mandarin. Yeah. Probably the easiest. <laughs> oh, Chan. My my it's wife is Chan, so we have oh, Chan. Mine, Chan is, mine is a different, different Chan. Oh, different Chan. Oh. Like yeah, here, put it on here. Mm -hmm. So, um, sure. you, you can, what I do, is I'll show you how to write your name. Maybe you can trace. Mm -hmm. You can just put it underneath it. Let me just put on your, your, your handout. You can then put uh, your. I think so this is this one. Yeah. This, okay. this was ours. Oh, then, oh, Jen. I see. Okay, I'll just put your name. And you can trace it. Okay. Right. Okay. Then you got something here. Well, I would write simplified. Yeah. Perfect. perfect. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's a good idea. Just like the 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 head stroke, but very tiny. You know. mm. Another dot. Two. This is the jet radical. Oh. Yeah. It's precious means. Okay. This is a difficult one. <laughs> yeah. yeah, just trace. You can do it. You can. You can try to. Where you can practice. I, uh, you, uh, okay. I think. Uh, okay, that's a good question. I think uh, on that corner, maybe this place would be good. Yeah. Oh yeah. 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 Good yeah, spot. yeah. Yeah. Okay, one for mom. You know how to write. Do you know how to write yourself? <laughs> oh, I'll write, I'll write yours first. Okay, okay. Think of what mine is. Okay, I'll write a little bit faster so you, you can see the stroke older. Mm -hmm, okay. mm -hmm. Cursive style. Ooh. <laughs> Okay, let me do it again. I think I did it, do it quite well, but it's okay maybe. You, you just feel free. To yeah, <laughs> to yeah, not yeah. Don't have to choose exactly. Just. Uh, okay, I'll try. Yeah, just do it free. It's a signature yeah, style. Signature yeah, signature style, yeah. however yeah. I want. Right, right, right. <laughs> And uh, maybe uh, you know how to write. No, I don't know how to write. The what's the <laughs> meaning of your, your Chinese name? You know the character? No. I no. forgot. <laughs> 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 you know what your Chinese name? No, I don't remember. I can't remember. Okay, just write the one I made for you. Okay, yeah. Sparrow. That's the one you made for me. Yeah, yeah sure. from, from your English name. Yeah. Sparrow. That's the bird. Yeah, that's This, this bird is Sparrow. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, just uh, one stroke, like the head stroke. Then Ma. I write the P, the 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 Romanized, yeah, Roman yeah, Roman yeah, yeah. Ma. Ch. 
确切 ，use Q stands for the sound。Use Chris H， 去，嗯，麻雀。Oh, very good, very good. No. Very good. Just tiny dot on the right side. Beautiful. Yeah, good. Don't don't make up. Just one stroke. Okay. It's, Writing is different than painting. It's very、uh, you just have to do it one stroke. So painting actually we call it yeah we call it for、uh, one stroke painting too.、Mm. So you have、um, one chance. Yeah, one one, one take. <laughs> yeah, one take. One chance. Right. Okay. Now、um, I have to prepare for, for the mounting work,、mm. and we would.、Mm -hmm. uh, Do this. Do this here.、Oh, let me clean up. I'll take a break for the audience, and you can come back for the mounting demo. Thanks for for your watching. Please stay tuned.